The following video will explain how to install your fabric cassette roller shade. Please note that the parts in this video may not be the same as product received. Begin by double checking the measurement where the shade will be installed. Measure two inch in from each end and make a mark for the end brackets. If installing above a trim reveal less than three quarters of an inch, you will mark three inch inches above for bracket placement. If trim reveal less is more than three quarters of an inch, you will mark four inch inches above instead. Next, line up your bracket and mark the wall using the screws holes provided. Using a 1 8 drill bit, pre-drill the holes to ensure an easy installation. Finally, us a Phillips head screwdriver or a hex head bit with a drill to attach the brackets. Make sure not to tighten your first screw all the way until you ensure the bracket is straight while placing the second screw. Then repeat this same process on the opposite side. To find placement for the center bracket, measure the distance between the end brackets and divide in two. Next, mark the center and the top of the bracket. Line up the brackets and mark the placement using the screw holes provided, pre-drill the holes, and attach the bracket. Once the brackets are attached, line up the cassette with the top groove and make it as centered on the opening. Gently push up to clip the shade into place. Before operating the shade, plug the charger into the shade until it moves. Once the shade has moved, you can unplug the charger. Please find your remote and test the shade. If limits are wrong, you can make adjustments to upper and lower positions using your remote if necessary. First, press up and allow the shade to stop. Press the up and down arrows at the same time for 7 seconds. The shade will jog to indicate you're ready to reset. Adjust up or down by using the controls on the remote until it's stopped in the desired position. Next, press and hold the MY button until the shade jogs. The new limit has now been saved for this shade. Repeat this sequence by pressing down to adjust the lower limit. First. Press down and allow the shade to stop. Press the up and down arrows at the same time for 7 seconds. The shade will job to indicate you're ready to reset. Adjust up or down by using the controls on the remote until it's stopped in the desired position. When the shade is where you want it, you will press and hold the MY bottom until the shade jogs, and this will save the new limit. You should now be able to run the shade up and down to the desired positions using the remote control.